This week's videos are sponsored by an app that I've been using since before we even partnered with them, and that app is Rocket Money. More on them after the reaction, people. Okay, citizens of the Reject Nation! Uh, that is right. Bullying does work. <laughs> I saw somebody comment that being like, so bullying is the answer. You bullied Greg into letting you do Chucky season one yeah. and it works. It works. Uh, that's not my stance in life, but it is my stance here, especially because Tara and I are completely obsessed with the Chuck. Oh my God, give me the Chuck all day long, love the Chuck. So here we are covering five, six, grab your crucifix. So that's a little inside baseball for our Nightmare on Elm Street people. Did we cover that franchise? Yes, we did. Are we covering the franchise of Chucky? Yes, we are. Are we also doing Friday the 13th? Yes, yes. we are. That's because Hi. we are your scream queens. We are your horror whores. We are the she jacks, baby. Yeah. Thank you guys so much for liking us. I know we love you for liking us. I know. Every time we see new fans and you guys giving us all the love in the comments, we absolutely adore it. I pinned myself all the time because my whole life I've been a true reject and yeah. here I actually feel accepted. We feel, we feel like we found family. Yeah, thank you guys. No joke. It's been really, really cool to do this franchise with you, especially the Chucky franchise. This is like one of my favorite franchises of all time. Tara's yeah, as well. Absolutely. We're completely obsessed. If you want to continue supporting us even more, don't forget to pick up your shirt today. If Tara would be so kind to moon you guys, you will see that we have an unbelievable... Oh, yeah. uh, oh it's on this side. No, no, it's here. No, it's on the it other side. There? Yeah, it was there. It was I right there. I forget the side. It was right there. Cult of Shejects, baby. Oh, there it is. Go to rejectnationshop.com. Is that right? Yeah. Rejectnationshop.com. It is like so cozy, so, comfy. so comfortable. They come in dope colors, five different colors. Please check them out. Already, we are one of the best sellers to hit fresh to the shop. We're yeah. trying to prove to Greg that we deserve the entire line. So please help us out there. Yeah. And we also don't have season two guaranteed here. So like, comment, subscribe. Bring the bell. Ring the bell. I know it sounds like we're asking you guys for a lot, but really it's all done in about 30 seconds. That's just making sure you like the thing, you subscribe, you leave a comment, let Greg know how much you want us to cover season two here. Yes. And then if you have it in you and you want to look cool like us, please go pick up one of these today. Just from the bottom of our hearts, thank you guys so yeah, much. I love you. Don't F with the Chuck and don't F with the Taryn Roxy. Okay, baby. Yeah, baby. Oh, we're getting uh, worse. Got it. That Got was it. a good one. Thank you so much to Prepper for helping us edit this down because I officially have the longest intros in the whole game. <laughs> Appreciate you guys. And thank you to the super sexy ones out there, the sexy rejects. That means that you've gone over to Patreon. If you haven't already, what are you doing? Go over to Patreon, sync up with your own copy over there. Also, that's where Greg and John cover stuff exclusively. Exclusively. <laughs> Who doesn't want something exclusive? Exclusive. Dude, it is Pride Month right now, and uh -huh. that clip from Chucky keeps playing of Jake asking him, like, you a queer kid you love? Gender fluid. And Chucky's like, yeah, I'm, I'm not, not a monster. monster. This whole franchise is so perfect for Pride so Month, good. and here we are to cover episodes five and six, so here we go. Shall we do it? Let's do it. Okay, let's do it. <laughs> I've been reading the comments. Lexi and Lexi's mom are mom and daughter in real life. <gasps> That's why they look so much alike. Also, Lexi's dad is from a movie that we should recognize in this franchise. Really? Oh, I don't remember him. Whoa, we, look we at the year. Okay, yeah, groovy. I even love those sunglasses. Let's go. I could see you rocking those. Right? That'd be fun. In Ooh. this sweater and those glasses, you get all Give the guys. Give me a purple martini, honey. I double dog dare you to talk like that for the whole episode. This, uh, this way? Yeah, that way. All right. I could do it. Triple dog dare you. <laughs> wow, it's been so long where I sexy danced with somebody. Right? Okay, so I, uh, that's Charles Lee Ray watching, right? It has to be. <laughs> oh. Oh, she likes it rough. Oh, he's over it. Fuck, Dwayne. Yeah, off, Dwayne. <laughs> Get out of here, Dwayne. Oh, she likes the blood. She just... All right. Okay, vampy. Was that him or no? 
I think it is, yeah. I want to smoke? Yes. Thanks. It's a shame your friend had to run off like that. Maybe that's my problem. Maybe I'm not looking for a friend. Maybe. Thanks for the light. Hey. Oh. Where are you going? I'm looking for something very specific. Okay. Is it Jennifer Tilly from the past? Oh. You know what I mean? Yeah, it could be. Because, like, is that yeah. a flashback? I don't know. Because we know That's that they've been together a long time. Yeah, could be. And we got to get Jennifer Tilly in this. I agree. Come on. Caroline. Where's Chucky? Oh, sweetie. I'm obsessed with her. Boo Boo's needs to rest up. Maybe you can see him in a little bit. I want Chucky. I want Chucky. Here we go. Chucky looks a little different now. <laughs> a lot different. <laughs> Okay, so if he was the doctor. Yeah, but I'm like, are we are we following that? I don't because well, it's I think, our Chucky. Right, right. I don't Yeah, we got the history of him. Good. He's gonna be woozy. Oh look at his eyeball. These effects on this guy is so good. Okay. He loves it. I'm feeling woozy. Yeah. Loroxy's gotta close her eyes here. <laughs> Thank God we cut uh, out of no, that no, for you. Yeah. Oh, look at our little new intro. It seems like Valentine's Day is coming up or something. Or does it just have to do with hearts? Because of the hospital? Yeah. No, it's giving Valentine's Day vibes for sure. Hot, hot, hot. Where's Chucky? I was thinking maybe I could take him to go get a Snickers or, or something. I hate Chucky. He's bad. It's all daisies until you dampen the mood. Not fair. I was just trying to help. She loved Chucky five minutes ago. Caroline's decided that she doesn't like Chucky anymore, so we took care of it. Fiona Dorf. Yeah. You Love saw her. it. I did. I saw it. Fiona Dorf. So Nika's going to be in the episode? I hope so, yeah. Why, do, she why are be. you like me? Because I was already prepped for it. Why? Because they had left that in the comments. Oh. Devin Sawa. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that, well, you had a, we had trouble with that one. <gasps> Jennifer <gasps> Taylor! <laughs> I knew it. It's got to oh, be flashback her, oh right? Oh, my God. It's got to be flashback her. I didn't know that. I'm looking for something very specific. No, wait. This is disgusting. I don't know what's worse. Stab with a butcher knife or a used needle. I'll do it. Swap this. We're in this together. Together. That's what I said. <laughs> oh, girl. Like, relax. Yeah, but the thing is, Lexi's still a B-I-T-C-A. You can't stay down there forever? You can't? What exactly are the rules for supernaturally possessed dolls? Lexi? Yeah. No, absolutely not. <laughs> There's like seven diseases to Tuesday in there. Did you not just say together? Yeah, you did say it. Pardon by me. <laughs> Devin's so great. He's so great. Follow my lead. And he's smart. Do you think he's still in there? I don't think so. I think he's going to be in that room somewhere and be like, hey, f***ers. <laughs> Or did it, all the things inside him, like, make him... Oh, make him, like, pass him out, or... Yeah, but I think you're right. I think he's in the room somewhere else. Oh. Oh. Ooh. Uh. Happy Pride Month, babies. So gross. It's so weird to think that that's so gross. Like, it's not... Could be a lot grosser because when they put those needles, Camille in a hospital, they have to cover the thing, yeah. then put it in the bag, wrap the bag up, then it gets. Yeah, and you've got the gloves on. It's not like yeah, shock, denial. That's normal. All of this is. Oh yeah, I s sad. That was sad. That's guilt. That's a cool way to remind. Uh, interesting us. editing choice. Yeah made a box everyone will heal at their own speed and if you need anyone to talk to please know my door is always open she's my fave teacher she's the best she's the only teacher right now but she's my fave okay everybody was making fun of us for thinking the detective should be in uniform but i just meant something like this like i know the detectives don't come in like whatever i've had to deal with detectives but like this where it's like more professional agreed he's a freaking doll maybe you left hack and sack no, he's a psychopath. Oh my God, Junior is gonna feel so left out. 
What do we do about Junior? Yeah. We should tell him. No, no, we can't bring him into this. He doesn't have the imagination. <laughs> what? Imagination. It's just the three of us. We had to think. No one's reported any weird shit since the hospital. So we're gonna accept that? Okay. Maybe we're going about this the wrong way. Maybe it's not where he's going next. I like the shot. Yeah. We know serial killers better than anyone. What do you think? Yeah, let's use his knowledge. Most of the time it's opportunity, but sometimes they fix it on a certain kind. What are you guys talking about? Nothing. No, oh, poor Junior. Yeah. Have you guys seen Westworld? <laughs> Crazy theme park with these hot robots and you can like do anything you want to them. It's really cool. I haven't no. been a little busy. I think that's the second reference. To Westworld? No, to HBO. Oh. This is all my fault. Oliver would still be alive if it wasn't for me. Pain's a lot easier if you let someone feel it with you. Yeah. Oh. So sweet. Did you so, hear him? Yeah, he's like, it pain's a lot easier if you let someone feel it with you, right? Yeah, yeah it's true. Close your eyes. What? Just do it. That's Just why me and Rocks understand each other. DPC club. DPC, 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 DPC. Think of everything you're feeling deep in your gut, unfiltered. You ever have those dreams where you're running a place? Oh. It feels like I'm running where all this crashing down because of something I did. Can't run to fix it. Can't run from it. Stuck somewhere in the middle and watching it all burn down. There's nothing I can do but pump my arms fast. Oh. oh my god oh his little smile oh i love that because that's such a good representation of like when you feel like time stops and they're doing a nice like time lapse here and i like the representation of that happy for you <laughs> duarto's gonna make this dump camera ready again in time for the new year's eve ball how much is that gonna cost us nothing it's on the good people of hackensack how are the people gonna feel about their tax dollars paying to clean up our mess they'll be happy to help restore order and the town hall tonight will be the perfect way to convince them you mean lie to them yeah i'm like is that illegal you're grounded what you caused all this you have to live in it with us you're grounded until i say you're not <laughs> Where are you going? Uh-uh. What? She's grounded. She's going to her room. Exactly. What? Every time she speaks, it's cheap silver on a mass-produced dinner plate. Look, show her some compassion. Yeah, yeah, dude. Like, you are not being a good mom. She nearly burned the whole damn house down, Nathan. I'm running a little low on compassion at the moment. Which I understand. But do we care more about how our life looks or how it feels? Ooh. Good question. Well, it's a sofa bed. Nana slept here, remember? Nana's dead. <laughs> <laughs> What do you think of that, huh? <laughs> I want my bed. I want my bed. I want my bed. Oh, God. I called this I called her spoiled, and everybody told me she's on the spectrum, so that wasn't nice of me. Oh, but I didn't realize that. She makes eye contact. I mean, I think it, that's why it's a spectrum. Okay, yeah. But I I, I don't was, know that she is not obviously on the oh. spectrum, though. I don't know whether that's right or wrong. Right. But Hi, it's I'm also Tommy. possible to be both. It, I agree. Exactly. I like to be hugged. Oh, you guys are right. Because she doesn't like to be touched. I'm with you. They did set that up. I just... Tommy would give me a hug, too? She makes good eye contact, so I, I didn't, didn't Yeah, but register that happens fully. sometimes with some yeah, people. Yeah, yeah. Looks different on everyone. What the... Oh, my God! <laughs> She's losing it. I love it. I love it. Oh, my God. It's... Oh, my God. It's a new good guy, doll. <laughs> What is she? Oh. <laughs> that was great. Oh my God. If she's grounded. Where is she going to go? Right? Like. Well, I have some good news. I made a few phone calls thanks to a favor owed. Junior, you're still going to nationals next month. He doesn't want to, I don't think. Is that really the best idea? The doctor did say that Junior was. I missed regionals because I was in the hospital. I didn't qualify for nationals. Isn't that kind of unfair? I Let this be a teaching moment, kid. Um, what's, the, what's the lesson? In life, when you get advantages, you have to take, take them. them. Is that the lesson? I mean, the thing is, he doesn't want the advantage. Yep. So we're going to have you back out there running. I even got you a trainer, that guy Dobbs. Ugh, you're pushing your kid too far, and you're not reading the signs here, buddy. Remember when you asked him in the hospital? What's she doing texting you? She hasn't returned my text all day. OK, phone now. Sorry, I, I can't do that. You can have it back after dinner. Hand over the phone, Jake. No. Boys, fight, fight, fight. I mean, the phone ass back. Boys, seriously. Oh, he's going to lose it. Drop it. It's going to remind him of his dad. Well, they were brothers, right? Right. So there's a well, little bit of that And they were the same actor. Right. <laughs> Devin Sawa. Maybe now is not the best time to have an extra son in the house. So rude. I'm not entirely sure that what you're doing is helpful. You're like, what are you suggesting? He goes into the 
foster care system. Like, come on, and dude. why is like, this house so beautiful? His brother just died, and also, yeah, it's awkward, but, like, you should be better with your son. Don't kick him out. Um, this actor, this young actor, makes some interesting choices. I agree with you on that, yeah. And the Oh my god, oh my god, that shot. That shot. His eye down here when it blinks, it's so good. Whoever did the design Do you think he's going to be able to put his himself into the other doll like we saw in the movies? Yeah, I bet. Uh-oh. Dad's about to freak out. Yeah, because he threw him out. Yeah. He, right that would be mad dumpster. confusing. Where did that come from? Lexi, this isn't funny. That's not fair. There's no way. Michelle, it's not a big deal. I was just going to throw it out. Go to your room. She doesn't have a room anymore, remember? And whose fault is that? Jesus, Michelle, will you just give it a rest? Like, seriously, Michelle, like, chill out. Like, go in your room and don't talk for a while. Listen, she's horrible, but also... She's I mean, she also raised like, kind of a... Like, Lexi hasn't had one moment where she was like, I can't believe I did this. I'm sorry I had I people agree. over. <laughs> yeah, I do agree with that, too. Don't ever undermine my authority in front of the kids. We talked about this. Oh, don't just rip those off like that. Mom or mayor? Choose, because I'm not so sure you can do both anymore. How about mom and mayor? Did you think of that? <laughs> because that's the best I can do, and I do it pretty damn well, if you ask me. I hate when actors aren't allowed to leave their mark. Yeah, I know, because it would have felt better mm -hmm. if she turned but away I, it and happened. walked away. Okay. For whatever shot purposes, they were running out of time that day. They were like, yeah. don't move. Uh, um, get, get the sack. Get the what? Get the stack? Sack, sack. Uh, okay. Are you sure this is going to work? No. no. Are you serious right now? What do you mean? It'll no. work. It has to. Okay. One. Oh, oh skunky. Oh, skunk. Oh, he's not. Okay. Oh my god. That's like right in his penis. Is it the old one or the new one? I think oh, it's the old one. But he already put his consciousness in the other one? Maybe. We, I mean, we haven't seen it, but I bet. Oh my god. Dead. Oh, they don't know. They don't know. What about Caroline's new doll? What about Tommy? No, I checked. Totally cool. Tommy's just a dumb doll. Dumb doll. Dumb Why are you girl. following me? <laughs> Hurry, the sun's coming up. Okay. <laughs> oh, they're so happy living in La La Land now. They're like, Chucky's dead and we get to live our lives. I've been thinking about my father lately. Huh. We did it. Chucky's gone. Really gone. Is that just like you said? Oh my god, are they gonna kiss? I was just thinking about that. What do we do now? Make out? I don't know. I don't we'll go back to normal, ready. I guess. They're not ready. Not yet. Sometimes I'm not sure what normal feels like anymore. I feel like that all the time. You do? Oh, no. I don't know. They might. Or maybe. He wants to kiss you. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, what is this? Stop, 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 stop. Oh, they're so cute. They're so cute because they're so awkward. I agree. It it was an awkward little kiss. I wonder if they're both gay in real life. I'm curious if those actors, the actors? are. Yeah, or if they're bi or whatever. Or if they're both straight. Uh, not that it matters, but uh, lately it's been casting. If you're playing LGBTQ, you have to be within. Yeah, but I don't think at that age, like, it'd be yeah, like right. online where they know right. or whatever. You're absolutely know. right, yeah. Is there something I can do for you? Yeah, maybe there is. Oh, circle kiss bed. Shaquille O'Neal's bed is a circle with the Superman symbol on it. Oh, really? Oh, my God. Oh, don't break my pearls. <laughs> wow. Oh, here we go. All right, we're getting right to it. Oh, they wanted to kill her together. She, she told him to wait. Do it. Do it to me now. She is like, oh, he, can he not get off if the girl says actually do it? He needs him to be scared. Charles, what the hell? Hello? What the hell? Oh. Oh. So oh. the other girl's Jennifer Tilly? <laughs> oh. Or this neither. took a turn or neither. <laughs> oh. You just had a nice orgasm from stabbing another girl. That's nice. Everybody loves to see that. Wow. <gasps> Jennifer. 
It's never happened like that before. Is that me? It changed her voice. Yes. Boy, you really know how to show a girl a good time. <laughs> <laughs> That's all Tiffany. You know what, Charles? You should be chucky. So it's ADR on this. You should be blonde. You should be blonde. Uh, 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 uh. Oh, the show. But I don't think I can keep this a secret anymore. Have you thought about telling Junior first? Do we know her? And as if Logan doesn't put enough pressure on Junior as it is. He just won't let up. Did you know that last night? Re your illness? Oh. Oh. Stage four cancer. Oh. Okay, that sucks. And so she's been on the phone with her doctors and stuff. You know I say the words and it still doesn't feel real. I just wanted to protect everyone for as long as I could. So I made a decision. I didn't tell them. I feel bad for calling her a cheater. Yeah. But just now I thought she wasn't. Right. I have to tell them. I will. I don't want to go through this alone. I'm like, you should at least just tell your husband. Keep it from the kid for a little while. No. He's yeah. old enough. Yeah, he is. Tell everybody. Oh, tell her. Because it's not fair to the thing. kid to not know because you want to give them the ability to change how they treat you. I agree. Because no teenager treats their parent perfectly. And to prep for that letting mm -hmm. that go. Yeah. These are all new people. That wasn't Nika. I don't. Is it? Oh my God, it is. But Chucky's in her body, remember? And Jennifer are Tilly. You not enjoying the show? Remember, but Chucky is in Nika. Nika, right. What do you want, little fella? I need a snack. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> Does look kind of yummy. Mm -hmm. I'm thrilled you've expanded mm -hmm. your palate, Chucky. I'm thrilled you expanded your palate. <laughs> You're always hungry. Yeah, I'm always hungry. You know, I'd say you were turning your mother, but that would be an improvement. My mother, always. You want to know why? <laughs> because love is strange. <laughs> oh. <laughs> what, what, what? Oh, oh, oh. Where am I? Oh my God, it's her. Yeah. Are you okay? Mm -hmm. oh, he must be so confused. Oh, oh my God. What is the date? November 8th, but I guess I, I don't know what. It's been two weeks. Please don't kill me. I'm not a killer. You don't understand. Are you fucking serious? <laughs> huh? I watched you murder. Oh. oh my God. My name is Nika Pierce. It Maybe don't tell him that. <laughs> is there a good guy to haul around here? A good guy what? This guy is like, what the F? Who's <laughs> Chucky? <laughs> he framed you for the murders and put me in a mental hospital. They need to do this, because like, if you haven't seen anything. If, yeah, because it would have been a minute. I can honestly see that. <laughs> Two weeks ago. I can honestly see that. <laughs> Ade Boku Gambela. So this is only two weeks after that. Inside me, and I, but I'm still here too. I, I could save you. I can fight him. Yeah, but is he gonna hurt her? I don't. I don't think so. I think he's just yeah. gonna run. No, of course he is. There. Okay. Yeah. And if you ever compare me to my mother again, I will cut your heart out and feed it to a stranger. Is it Chucky again? That was weird. Uh. Whoa! <sighs> Draw my knife. But don't do it again. You wanna eat? Let's see. Mm, wet work for dessert. My favorite. She is good. Yeah, she's great. I did not know the series was going to go here. Nice job, Dorif, on having a daughter who can act. Best if we keep this Nika bullshit between us, huh? Oh, ho, ho, yeah, baby. Oh, that's a great role for her. That really looked awesome. Good. Yeah, good job, man. Brianna, you ready to kick some matches? Oh, no, where's Junior? Oh. oh, that's awkward. You just tell him about Chucky. Tell him he's dead. My mom's not going to believe that. Nobody will believe us. What, what do they do? Move. Oh. Let's see, what the hell? Oh, my God. Jake's doll Chucky was alive, and he killed his dad, and he killed Oliver, and the cop at the hospital, and your housekeeper, too, and he wouldn't stop killing, so we broke him into pieces, and now he's dead, so everyone can stop worrying about it. You can stop worrying about it, too. <laughs> if you don't want to tell me what's going on, fine, but... Making up stupid shit like that is just embarrassing. Grow up, Lexi. Yeah, because you can't say it like that, bro. Thoughts and prayers for anyone who has lost an acquaintance or loved one. 
Second, I am here to tell you that Hackensack has never been safer. We are still the best darn big little city in America. Oh my God. You're an idiot. Uh, Nightmare. Yeah, this is the worst. That I am doing everything in my power to keep you all happy and healthy because nothing is more important to me than family. <laughs> yeah. You're the Thank you so much. What is wrong with her? I mean, they, the family knew this was gonna go terribly. This is about the ongoing investigation into every one of these recent deaths. This is about the curfew, which goes into effect tonight. Curfew? It's about getting to the bottom of this so that we can all live our lives without living in fear. She's the one who told Devin he couldn't hang out with Jake, though. I uh, yeah, like I'm that. like, is this the first live time she's gonna see living in the fear. handhold? No. I knew it. Live our lives without living in fear. Principal McVeigh would like to say a few words. Oh no, did Chucky kill him? Principal McVeigh. Off with their heads. That's the song. <gasps> His head's about to roll. Yeah. Off, off. Like, oh, yep. no, 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 no. I am a prediction you queen. You did a good job with that. Dance, dance till you're dead. I knew it. Woo! Heads will roll. Heads will roll on the floor. Nice. Love that. Love that. <laughs> What a needle drop. Oh, uh, that's fun. Yeah. The girls cry out. You look like a tuna mouth. <laughs> you do look like a tuna mouth. Uh, yeah. There we have it. We're going to see a little change. Hi, oh. I'm Tommy. On a play. <laughs> All right. Unreal. We're going to click real. the next one. Guys, in between these, don't forget, rejectnationshop.com. Pick up your sweaters. Thank goodness for this thing. Get it. I was just in Charlestown. I was just there for my first time. Oh. For 36 hours. South Carolina. There's no direct flights from LA. Who knew? This is Andy. No, it's not. Is it Andy or no? I mean, you, that's kind of a good call. Might be. Can I help you? Is this the Morrison resident? That's him. We have a few minutes of your time. Well, we were just about to sit down to eat. Oh, this won't take long. Oh, that is him. So how many members in the household? Just the three of us. Ages? 39. And Becky here just turned seven. Was it Alex Vincent, right? Any recent property damage? No, not that I can think of. Any fires or major injuries? God, no. Oh, we have to ask. Any new dolls? Oh, my God. <laughs> Be chill. What kind of census are you taking exactly? A Chucky census. You know, we ask a few questions to get the kids excited about the census. But Becky, why don't you uh, go get some of your friends from your room? Is this the girl that Andy escaped with in, like, the second movie or first movie or something? Remember the blonde older girl that he escaped with? Right. Here's Binti and Mrs. Fluff. Are these all your friends? Because it's really important that we count everyone. It has to be if she's asking that question. Because at first I was like, no, she's against it. But now she's with him. I forgot Charlie. Oh, go get him. Go get him. Hi, Wait. I'm Charlie. That's the Charlie from the psych ward because his burnt fingers with the candle. Right. You made me do this. Do what? <gasps> Do oh. oh. Andy! That's a cool shot. Love that. Drop with the music. Ah, ah. Love it. Love it, love it, love it, love it. This one's all glass. I wonder why. The title sequence is sick. Yeah, they're the best. That little girl, she's going to be traumatized. Better than dead. She'll be alive. Yeah. yeah. Besides, you and me went through a lot as kids. Come on! Yeah, I knew it. It was that girl. Yeah. It was the second movie from the yeah, it was foster so cute, system. When they walked out, she's like, he's like, where are we going to go? And she said, home. Why didn't you tell me you were keeping a living Chucky head locked in a safe? Oh, yeah. Why did you keep him alive for four years? Yep. Something I picked up in military school. Get to know your enemy. You can learn a lot from a POW. You persuade him hard enough. He screams the loudest at fire. Those screams were my favorite. Oh my god. Oh boy. Here we go. Okay, so there's just one left, right? One doll left. Jennifer Tilly. Alright, I was waiting for that. Me too. 
Chucky broke his soul into pieces, but the last piece it didn't go into a doll. Where did it go? Let's just say that murder isn't the worst thing Chucky can do to you. Inhabit your body, Nika. Yeah. They did so many smart things with this series, but the fact that they introduced the kids first so we would have time to care about them before bringing in Andy and Nika. I agree. It's like we needed time with them. We needed time with Lexi and Devin yeah. and uh, Jake. We needed those. It's just so smart. Yeah. Rachel Fairchild, you're under arrest. What? For the murders of Megan McVeigh, Oliver Hayden, and Detective Sean Payton. What? What, are you joking? Mom, she didn't do it. How do you know she didn't do it? I just do. It sucks they don't have any, like, video proof of, yeah, like... What makes you think she did do it? Right. Chucky must Chucky planted her evidence, yeah. yeah. Obviously, but... Chucky hates teachers. He does. I mean, it, she would have been better off if he drug her in the closet again just killed her rather than her being accused of three murders i don't agree with that i mean i don't know it's like the worst for her right now you should have told him about chucky we can't just tell anyone we have to find him and kill him but we did kill him i mean we were all there you have to prove that she's yeah. innocent y'all how do you do that it's gotta be tommy wait your sister's doll i thought you said you checked him out i did now he's missing well how's that even possible this is serious i love when people in a group are like this is serious right do you think we don't know that yeah, like, we're aware. He was this kid in the 80s whose babysitter was murdered. He always said Chucky did it. It all comes back to Andy Barkley. Oh, well, you think he'll know how to find Chucky? Maybe. Let's talk to him. Devin, smart guy. Oh. What is... Can't <laughs> oh. <laughs> nah. The wall closed. You gotta take it off the bed. You can't try to close it on the bed, babe. You're the body disposal expert. I am disposing as best as I can. This outfit is iconic. I agreed. Key is smaller pieces for optimal pack. Rolling your t-shirts instead of folding. Shut up, Chucky! Fiona Dorif is so talented. <laughs> she's so good. You want? I love oh, her. Oh no, it's it's about to be. It's about to be. She's gonna oh, fall down. She's gonna. Yeah, that yeah, wakes her up. She's going blood. down. All right, here we go. Oh. Oh. This is so cool. What an interesting dynamic. Love that that was in one shot. Her oh f when she's still Chucky down, she turns back to herself. They can only do that because Fiona's a stud. Yeah, agreed. Comfortably seat six. This car. Perfect for the oh yeah, is the that's maybe why she did it. I don't know. Chucky is perfect. How much? Thousand bucks. Though there is uh, one thing that legally I'm bound to disclose to you. There was a murder in this car. Certainly this car was an, there was an axe. A young couple uh, got killed. Well, if you must know, uh, I believe they were decapitated. Both of them. Are they ADRing both of them? We'll take it. The whole time? Really? Yeah, I think so. Good for you. It's a stunning automobile, and a true classic never goes out of style. Oh, no. Technically, it isn't even an antique. Uh, is it vintage? Uh, retro? It's not vintage. Or retro. Or an antique. It's just old. Kind of like you. Okay. Don't worry. We're going to give you another paint job, too. Oh. <laughs> Oh my god. That's a thousand bucks. <laughs> he said that's a thousand bucks. I, I was like, did the guy say that? <laughs> that's he's dying? I just love that color. Yeah, it matches your lip gloss. Ew. Ugh. You could pick up Gross. things that you don't want. What's that? It's a hobby. Is this voodoo? Oh, that's how he learned. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Come back soon. All right. <laughs> Oh, she told uh, them. Yeah. That was a good good job that they we didn't need to hear it. I agree. I'm going to call him in. To tell him. Junior, can you come in here for a minute, please? Oh, no. Oh, this is tough. I come have a seat for a sec. It's already written all over her Remember face. these conversations? I do not. <laughs> Mom, what's going on? Been there, buddy. Your mother is... Excuse me. Oh, no, don't leave the room. No, you shouldn't have done that, Dad. You gotta stick it through. There's something I have to tell you, and there's no easy way to say it. I'm sick. I don't want you to worry. Maybe give some details. Yeah, I can. It's cancer. I can't believe the dad left the room. Yeah, it's... I mean, I, he has not been doing good dad stuff. He's failing. We're gonna get through this together, Ginger. Please don't worry. <laughs> They're asking a lot of these actors these episodes, and... I agree. They're not... The, the dialogue is not giving him as much to work with. Right. Not at all. Because he didn't have many lines. There wasn't too much to like work up into yeah. it. 
Yeah, but I guess we're just pushing through it. Yeah. I guess today is my lucky day, huh? I don't remember you being dumb enough to chase an inside street, even if you are lucky enough to get it. <laughs> Her voice keeps changing. It's funny. Yeah. You know what this motel reminds me oh, of? Oh, is she faking it? But how? But what about her legs? How'd she get in that chair? I think you're right, though. You remember Niagara, Chucky? You know, I'm more of a, of a live in the present kind of guy. Oh, no, she knows. Yeah. What was your favorite part? Come on, Tiff. That was a long time ago. Raise you a hundred. I call. Bluff. I'm all in. All right. She's going to ask him to go get her something. Yeah, that's not going to work. Hello, Nika. Hmm. Is it Chucky doesn't bluff? Chucky bluffs, mm. but he doesn't chew on his fingernail. <laughs> ah. Besides, I stabbed you in the thigh 10 minutes ago. <sighs> ah. You didn't feel a thing. Oh. What are you going to do to me? I don't know. That's an interesting question. Mm -hmm. This is so great. Sometimes when we're together, I see you looking at me, and I know it's you. Oh, OK. I live for those moments. Oh my god. I want to have those moments all the time. Mm -hmm. Oh. I have a surprise for you, Nika. I bought us a house. What? Right here in Hackensack. They say the same. Look over everybody that lives in Hackensack, even non traditional couples. <laughs> <laughs> Tiffany is batshit. Yeah. I love her. Totally. How do I keep you in the driver's seat instead of that rat, Chucky? <laughs> Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, what? Okay. This show came to play. It's not an Insta. Oh my oh, god. Snap. It's like I'm so obsessed with them. It's now we're. Yeah. Okay, okay. Pivot, pivot, pivot. I Googled Andy Barkley and got an article from two weeks ago. Violent patient escapes Harrogate Psychiatric Hospital. Harrogate? Where is that? Rhode Island. Wait, I got a call from Rhode Island about a month ago. Holy like, shit, that must be Andy Barkley. Remember? Yeah. Okay. Junior, I'm so sorry. Remember? I just feel like everything's falling apart right now. My mom. Us. My uncle. Even you and me. Mm -hmm. Yeah, for sure. I just feel like you're somewhere else these days. I'm sorry, what? What yeah. about Facebook? Who said that? And it's like you said, everything has just been such a mess lately, and I just want to protect you. No, it's over. She looks like Sabrina Carpenter when she was young. We're done. Whoa, he just broke it off. You could have just told him. It's, you got to tell him. You think him. that's going to stick? No. Please don't do this. We can fix this. Please, please, For please. now it is, but it'll come back. But I'm like, you need to just tell him the truth and tell him why. It's just brutal when you find out that your parent is sick with cancer and then you start like ripping your own life apart. Yeah, <laughs> self sabotage. Andy Barkley? Jake Wheeler, where are you? Okay. In Hackensack? You know about Chucky and you're still alive. Makes you one of the lucky few. Mm -hmm. He feels lucky. Yeah. Listen, Andy, I have like a million questions, but we're out of time and we need your help. How do we find him? Is it like, who's we? Oh, you don't have to find Chucky. He'll find you. And if he can't find you, he'll go after your whole family to get to you. He killed our foster parents, Jake. He'll stop at nothing. That wasn't the most helpful. It'll be somewhere he's familiar with, and you're at your most vulnerable. Junior so. Not a bad place to spring a trap. Well, text me the address. We're on our way. Okay, that's helpful. All right. I thought he was saying, like, we're not coming. Oh, my God. Oh, She's, this vibe is great. I'm just obsessed with her. I'm so in love with Jennifer Tilly. It, is, it hurts. She's so great. Gladys. Gladys. <laughs> what brings you to Hackensack? Well, my fiance grew up here, actually, right in this very house. It's just been empty ever since. Ever since the murders. Yeah. Ah. <laughs> the way she said that. So it was your fiance's parents that. <laughs> yes. yes, so many memories. Oh my God. Oh God. You know, I almost forgot. You've already started getting some mail. Oh, Chuck. I have an online shopping addiction. <laughs> okay. Would you like my autograph next time? <laughs> Welcome home. Uh, <laughs> how are you going to get her inside? You're such a baby. Look how sweet you look. I thought it was going to be Chucky when she woke up. Don't do anything I wouldn't do. <laughs> Damn, she is so... They're the two of them are like so... Fire. It's the best. Yeah. We found your fingerprints everywhere in the office. 
this. I haven't even gotten started on Oliver Hayden. He was your student, wasn't he? Oh, and then there's your juvenile record. What was that? Maybe McVeigh found out about your delinquent past. So yeah, wait for the lawyer. Uh, You're gonna need one. It was Chucky. Yeah, but none of that is proof that, like, I don't get it. Devin's mom sucks at her job. I agree. Mom? Mm -hmm. What do you talk about in there? Oh, is it a support group, probably? Or therapy that you've seen her in. Yeah. All the things we don't talk about at home. Why don't we talk about them at home? I don't know. Because your dad doesn't get it. You talk about me? All the time. You're my favorite topic of conversation. They look a lot alike. They do. It's good casting. Yeah, it's always hard when uh, people are ethnically ambiguous to make, and they look so similar. I wonder yeah. what both their backgrounds are. I'll be right back. Oh no, where'd we hear that from? Right, I don't, is he under the car? Sounded outside. I told them I was honest about the cancer and my chances. It's all out in the open now. And she's looking out, is she gonna see something? Some things aren't meant to be shared, so I've made another decision. Oh, she's gonna stop therapy? I'm refusing treatment. Oh. I just wanna live my life with my family, with whatever time that I have left. Oh man. I could walk out of this office right now and get hit by a bus. Who knows what could happen? Could be something very special. Or you could fight it. The important thing is for me to save her what time I have left. My friend Skyler's mom got diagnosed with stage four cancer two years ago. She's still kicking. My mom had stage four cancer for three and a half years. There you go. I bet somebody at the National Brain Tumor Society walk who had a glioblastoma, which is the most deadly cancer for 17 years. He's still Whoa! alive. I was like, Okay, champ. That's wild. He did a 5K with us. I was like, that's my dude. That's some inspo right there. I never feel so Here we go, the drop. Dun. <laughs> Up and Is he going to push her out the window? I don't think so. Like, out the window? I feel like mom's going to die right now. Because this song is like, when I wow. think of dying, I've never felt more wow. in love. Interesting. <laughs> Uh, and she just decided she's not gonna. Wow, wow, yeah, wow. yeah, totally, totally. Good one. Totally. I did not think we were gonna lose her just now. Yeah, there's the glass from the oh titling. My God. Poor, and we know that the car is right there. Yeah. JJ is oh Junior is gonna, it's gonna go right on top. Wow, oh my god, he sees her. Guy. Okay. Oh, oh. Shot! Oh my God, this kid's gonna be fucked up for years. Ah! You don't recover from that, and your dad is. Oh my God. She didn't seem. I don't understand. She made it sound like everything was fine. They think she jumped. So that's it. She just decided to hell with all of us. She just gave up. That's so unfair. She didn't want her treatment to overtake your lives. You must understand. Your mother loved you all. Very much. Yeah, but you wouldn't have jumped on your car. Right. And you can't really Also, the physics of it don't make it. sense. Yeah. You're throwing you'd have to out the run window. and sprint. I'm like, the only way, if they're not doing it good enough, is that she could have thrown the file thing if that broke the window enough and then really broke it to throw herself out. But I'm like, come on now. I don't think your mother killed herself. He's not going to believe him. He's going to be like, you're nuts. Stay the away from I thought me. he was going to say, stay the away from me. We were fine before you came along. I don't know what movie this is from. Tell us in the comments. We should know, right? Well, it's definitely some kind of Bible thing. Oh. oh. Why don't we know this movie? Look I don't at know. Robert De Niro. I have to head back to the station. I don't remember. Curfew is still in effect. Promise me you'll stay inside. He didn't say anything. Devin, I know I've been hard on you lately, and I know that I was wrong about Jake, and I'm sorry. I should have trusted you. Hey, Mom, can I ask you something? Yeah. His room is giant. How do you know if you really like someone? When I first met your father, I couldn't stop thinking about him. I had butterflies in my stomach whenever he was around. I miss that feeling. Yeah, right? I'm like, how do you get that back? Is that how you feel about Jake? Yeah. Aw, so sweet. I was worried he wouldn't look at me the same. Honey, this doesn't change anything. You're my son, and I'll always love you. That's how parents should roll. I love you, Mom. Totally. She might suck at being a detective, but yeah. decent mom moves. Good at being a mom. I like that that coming out story, he never had to actually didn't say Didn't have them. to really say anything, right? She, He just was... Because she didn't say, 
like you're gay, right? No. She just said a bad gay. Yeah. yeah, which is a great way to. I really, yeah. I thought that was beautiful. Oh, Kevin Bacon. Was that who that just was? It looked like it. I don't know what this movie is, which is probably a bummer. I, mean, I don't know what this is. Yeah, Cape tag Fear? this in the comments because I don't know is it this either. this Cape Fear? And that means we should watch it. I probably saw it at some point. Well, it's monofilament line. Got it from Sam's oh. fishing gear. See, what I do is I stretch it across the windows and the doors and tie it to Danny's teddy bear here. The bear moves a quarter of an inch. I know if the Holy Ghost is sneaking in. Oh, okay. So that's where Home Alone got it. What do you need the taser for? I don't know, but that was an interesting CG moment. Agreed. Oh, they're going to do a setup. Got it. Okay, we're going into yeah. Home Alone setup. All right. Trap, trap, trap. Trap the Chuck. We'll know if the Holy Ghost sneaks in. How do you get out? <laughs> He's using the same line. She's our alarm. We have an alarm, and it's from Miss Century. Well, we don't want the cops here. I don't want my mom here, okay? Smart. Yeah. Listen to the smart one. Yeah, but how did he get here? This vantage point is upstairs. My room. Rock, paper, scissors. Seriously? Hey, just, just don't touch any of my stuff. Well, I'm glad she's not complaining. She's one up. That's good, because that's yeah. a first from her. That's yeah, his mom. <laughs> Remember, you're grounded. How, what are you going to do? I talked to my mom. Told I'm into someone. <laughs> you. So cute. So cute. I can't even stand it. You know, maybe when this is all over, maybe we could go on a date. You know, one that doesn't involve hunting a killer dog. <laughs> Definitely. <laughs> oh my god. What kind of movies are you into? Horror movies. They might kiss right now. Favorite friend or girl? Lori Strode, hands down. Whoa. Oh, okay. Jamie Lee's gonna win the Saturn this year. She's gonna win an Oscar. She's magnificent. <laughs> She's fabulous. <laughs> Love this dialogue. What a shout out to Halloween. Agreed. Got a lot more than goosebumps and anyways to scare us. Oh. Oh, it's a shark is here. Man, is Dang. that the end of it? Oh. No, no, not yet. But what if it's Junior or something? I don't know. Also, why does it keep going back and forth? Trying to pick the lock? I don't know. Perch! Oh, dang. Oh. Fortress. <laughs> His laugh. <laughs> All right, where he broke oh, a lamp. No. I'm sure that Jake's going to be blamed for that one. Oh, oh. is he up the chimney? That never happened in Cape Fear. Cape Fear? Oh! De Niro could have never forgotten I've never the chimney. Seen it. No, dude, he was totally ripped in that. <laughs> De Niro was ripped in that. Oh. What's up with Lexi upstairs? I know, right? What's she doing? She's quiet. Like, maybe tell her that he's in the house. Right, I agree. Like, we're. Oh, <laughs> that's a great little shot. Ah! Oh my god! And thank you for the reminder. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't even see it coming. I just did it to you and you did not move. That was good. Oh, he turned oh, no. on. Okay. We're cooking with gas now. Now uh, we're cooking with gas. That's such a nice kitchen. I mean, it's so hard as an adult to not just be distracted by how much money those appliances would cost. Totally. Oh, where is he? He purged him. Yeah, he did. He's, he's messing with us. Poor thing. Oh. Jake? Jake! Uh-oh. You better jump out the window, girl. I got you now. Jump out that window. But I'll let you go on one condition. What? It's out the window. All you gotta do is kill Jake. Huh. Why? Don't tell me you've never thought about it. You get off on hurting Jake. Okay, fine, I'll admit it. I have thought about it. You're being way too loud, Jake. Yeah, like... Jackie knows. She needs to talk louder. You want to know how I do it? Duh. I'm all ears. God, that's going to go off. He's going to hear it. Beat him to death. With a bat. With this. Can I watch? Oh! Hurry up! Do it, Lexi! <laughs> oh! What the... Oh, the taser. Shit. Uh, I'm too old for this. Oh, my God. <laughs> Something happens to Dev and I riot. Yeah, oh, they, they can't be. No, 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 no. Oh, he just ran out. Okay. He didn't even try to kill me. Me neither. What the hell? Hello? Oh, no. 
Oh, not the. Is he going by the moms? He's going for the family, like Mom? he said on the phone. She, she tracked his phone. Yeah. Hey, Gavin, what? They take. He takes the family first. Oh no! Oh, oh no! Oh. Dang it! Dang it! Oh! Whoa! Oh. Oh my God, his little run and laugh. Uh, That's why she had to come to here, come to Jesus moment. Poor thing. She's oh, got, he got left is the Blondie's parents. Because now these two are orphans together. Wow, this show is not afraid to kill off a lot of characters. Yep, they're going for it. I like it. Wow, that's wild. The twist. Her body. Yeah, that's Damn, crazy. Dude. Okay, do wow. not play the next wow. one. Wow, 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 wow. All Here, right. You know what's crazy, too, though? All right, Reject Nation, let's get real for a moment. Running this channel is incredible, but managing finances, especially taxes and budgeting, both for the channel and my personal life, can be overwhelming. That's where Rocket Money has been a financial lifesaver for me, even before I ever partnered up with them. Like I said, I've been very fortunate to be working with brands whose products I already use, so it's a win-win for them. Why? But it can be a win-win for you, too, because there's a reason I use them. Rocket Money is a personal finance app that simplifies managing money by canceling unnecessary subscriptions, lowering bills, and crafting a budget that fits your specific lifestyle. For someone like me who can easily lose track of expenses throughout every single day of the month, it's been eye-opening to see where I was overspending, stuff I don't use that I kept paying for, especially apps. Man, I was way too many apps. Rocket Money does the heavy lifting by analyzing your spending, then customizes notifications to help you stay within your budget goals. It's not just about saving money. It's about actively seeing and feeling your financial progress. It's a great feeling. They track your monthly subscriptions too. So many free trials I've signed up for that I forgot to, you know, get rid of before the free trial was done. Making it super easy to cancel the ones you don't use. A couple of clicks and you're putting money back in your pocket. I'm telling you, have you ever found hidden subscriptions or pay for services you forgot about? Because Rocket Money is a huge asset in helping to uncover those and even negotiate some of my bills down to up to like 20%. So if you're ready to take control of your finances and there's no better time than now because it is the beginning of the year, check out Rocket Money and see how much you could be saving. Stop wasting money on things you do not use. So to help support the channel and help support your wallet, visit rocketmoney.com slash rejects. Rocket Money currently has over 5 million users and has helped save its members an average of $720 a year with over $500 million in canceled subscriptions. They've helped me and I'm confident they'll do the same for you. That's rocketmoney.com slash rejects. Your bank account will thank you. Because there's so many kills and so many twists and so much stuff. But the fact that I guessed one of the kills with the head and you guessed the other kill the with other the car. Because we are just like... We are Chucky. I know. <laughs> we are. We love Chuck so much. We love Chuck like, so much. This that is our favorite. Yeah, by like, far. By, There's never just... been one bad Chucky anything ever. Like, he, he, this is the most watchable show and movie and franchise ever. I agree. Absolutely. Because we found. You know, even with us watching Nightmare on Elm and we just started Friday the 13th, but we we haven't felt that. I mean, we like them definitely. And we loved like we loved them, too. But there's a different aspect. There's a different type of like joy and excitement that happens right off the bat with Chucky. And they find a way to have done that for eight movies plus a TV show, which to me is insane. I think insane. it has a lot to do with Dorif. Because of his voice and his characteristics, the way he plays Chucky. Both Doris, bro, but yeah, Agreed. Brad for sure, but Brad, Fiona but, but, too. I mean, she's phenomenal, but we only got her in one movie. Thankfully, she's back in the TV show, or we got her in two movies. But anyway, like, it's just, I mean, I love it. It's so freaking so good. we have a couple things that we have to remind you guys. Then yeah. we are going to get more into episode five and six and our thoughts on it. But number one, as we sit here, uh, I just can't express enough, and I wouldn't tell you if it wasn't true. I have worn a lot of crew necks in my life. This is my absolute favorite one. The best. There's something about the feeling of it Soft. where it's like feels already worn in. Yeah. You know what I agreed. mean? Like when we got really it comfortable. Yes. It was already like I'd been wearing it for years. Yeah. Um, it's just amazing. And it has our cult of she Jex logo on the back. If you haven't bought one already, here's a couple reasons to think about it. Number one, you'll look really cool. Number two, it comes in five different colors. So there's definitely something for you. Yes. Boy, girl, she, they, gay, whatever All of it. for everybody. Number three, it helps support Tara and I and this entire channel. And number four, if these do well, we can keep our merch line going. Yeah, which Cult we would of love Shijex. to. Right. Like, We've we got ideas. To. we got and thoughts. And we, we're going to get this going too. But like, see our little our little logo there? We'd love it. And we want to get more of these out. But we've got to show them with a, with a full show out of 
you guys buy, you got to buy these up, baby. Get them for yourself. We heard that one. Today we got the numbers and we heard one person got uh, three, three different colors, which three, like, which I, we adore. you're a real one. Right. Whoever that is, we love you. Thank Obsessed, you. Obsessed, whether yes. it's for your, for your sister, your brother, your mom, your dad, your nieces and nephews yourself gift yeah. to you you deserve it okay that's number one number two if you are on apple or spotify please give us that five star we want that five star push us up in the podcast yeah. and also if you are on youtube leave a comment you guys know we don't know if we can continue doing this for the season two right only we prove to greg that we deserve to be here and we only have two episodes left i believe it's only eight episodes that's that like or we would have three me. No, two, six, if six, Gre- seven. If you three. guys don't show up and yeah. we don't get enough comments and views and likes and all of that, Tara, are we watching I, together in one of our apartments? Because, like, I can't I, watch them Yeah, yeah. because we, if we, and, there, no, it'd be too no. weird. Like, you guys got to show up on, on FaceTime because I can't do this without you, babe. We have uh, to. Okay, so we just did five and six. Now we're finally getting into real Chucky. By yeah. real Chucky, I mean the world of Chucky. What's cool about episode one, two, three, four, they were like, okay, we welcome new fans. Come one, come all. All you have to know about is this doll. But there really, there was that phone call from Andy, but it wasn't that tied into the universe. Although we did get a little about Chucky's past and we did get a little bit about his part, old partner in crime that he had killed to start the Chucky franchise. But it wasn't like our main players. And now they're like, oh yeah, you already love this show. You love watching the dynamic between Junior and Lexi and Devin and Jake, and you like watching the dynamic between the parents, the cops, the everybody, the mayor, everyone involved. Yeah. Okay, let's just level ourselves up and let's bring you Andy. Let's bring you Nika. Let's bring you Tiffany. Like all the franchise favorites are here and back, and it makes sense why they're why they're here. Yeah. It doesn't feel shoehorned in. It's just the show is moi, Chef's Kiss. It, it deserves to be a TV show because we can do so much more with it. Mm-hmm. I'm just obsessed with this. I agree. The way that they're building out the world while giving us so many Easter eggs in this show while still leaving it open for a new audience to just get on board. You don't have to have watched all the movies, but the Easter eggs that we're getting make it so, so exciting. And the way that they did really uh, cool editing to remind us of the murders that had happened that... They, they, they had planted like on the teacher and also just doing some flashbacks to how we might know Nika and how we might know Jennifer, I think is a lot of fun. But I think um, it gives us a, uh, there's a large area to play with Andy now. And I forget what her name was, yeah, the blonde, too. but, but there's, we're, to the be able to play sister. with them once they show up probably at that house and there we see the mom is dead now. For the penultimate and the final, I bet that they'll be yes, there. Yes, that they are gonna, they're gonna have to come through because they know what, what, where Chucky is going and I love that, that shot of like, it's kind of like a Pulp Fiction shot where they shoot Chucky and they're like, thanks for your, thanks for your time. I loved to see Andy and her together doing that and killing Chucky that I think we're going to get another Pulp Fiction-esque, especially seeing her by the car. Did you see Did you notice how she's in full leather jacket? I'm like, we're we're doing some Pulp Fiction. Like, Who's in full leather jacket? Who are you talking the, about? The girl, the blonde girl who's with Andy, who oh. I forget her name. Okay, yeah, yeah. She the foster in, sister. The foster from, yeah, yeah. sister. She's in full leather. They're ready to F some shit up. Yes. And I, when they arrive... With these kids now, now they're, we got two orphans. I think Chucky's headed for the blonde girl's family. Um, who knows? But I can't wait to see Andy and the blonde. The Lexi the or for Lexi? I think Chucky is Which going bl- for Lexi's parents because he the mayor and the mayor and the dad. Um, because I think that's that's the way he rolls. I mean, Andy was like, listen, they're going to F your family up. They come for your family first. I think he's going to go for the parents. What about them. the sister? That's that's a good question. But they have a good relationship have, so far, but I that agree. doesn't mean anything to Chucky. I'm super curious about what Jennifer Tilly's plan is, or what Tiffany's plan is with Nika in the house. Right. She's right. like, I would rather be with you than Chucky, yeah. than Charles. She's brought him to Charles' uh, family home, creepiest thing I've ever seen. I, but when she knocks him out, it doesn't wake up as Charles, wakes up as Nika. Mm-hmm. So I'm so curious about that, too. What are the rules? We know when 
when uh, Charles sees blood, he turns into Nika. But what? How do we get Nika back into Charles? That will be interesting to see. I love if if uh, Dorf wasn't so talented. This would suck. It wouldn't work. It would absolutely suck. I agree with you 110% on that. The, but her the and Jennifer Tilly are switch. both like mm, chef's kiss, mm -hmm. uh, which we need because the kids in this are kids still. But it works because they are awkward kids, you know, yeah, and are. being that age is awkward. And like having your first crush is awkward and going in for your first kiss is awkward. It's weird. <laughs> and yeah. I love that this show didn't cast a bunch of 25 year olds to play um, teenagers thir because they're yeah. middle school. They are. They're, They're 13, young. you know, and so like it should feel a little awkward. Jake should feel a little awkward, uh, you know, and then like Lexi is just this confident queen. I'm just really loving all these characters. I'm curious what ends up happening with Junior and Lexi. They got to get back together, I would think. Wow, man, yeah. I'm invested. I'm invested across the board. Every storyline, every character, nothing's pulling me away or out just really truly interested there's still so many people that we might kill off i can't believe they killed off the mom yep. once we knew she had stage four cancer i thought like oh okay so she, we'll we'll see the progression whatever and the show was just like no pop boom and they gave us they gave us the the reason i really saw it coming is the song choice the words in it it was like yeah they'd already done that my heart like my once my heart's free i know it can like let go or whatever and i was like oh she has like let go saying like, and here we go. And I knew she was going to go right out that window. That shot of her face through the window <laughs> was great. It was terrible, but it was a great shot. The fact that it lands on his car right in front of Jake's face is, I mean, yeah, Jake's face is, I mean, it's a lot. It's just, it's so horror-esque the way that they are delivering these things. And I, I really enjoy it because it still has that pop horror-esque fashion yes. to it. And especially with even the pickup, the crane shot at the very end of, of the mom after she fell down the stairs and her spine is totally twisted. Like her arms are back. I mean, it was a great shot. I don't know how they, they set those shots up. It looked phenomenal. Um, and I that was think crazy. them following that pop horror that we have loved from the first movie, and that's why we love it so much. Nine films in. You're saying as a TV, genre, pop as horror? A, yeah, kind of like they're, they're, that's kind of what Chucky, Chucky, it finds a way to still make us laugh and give us that horror, but it's not like, <sighs> it's like, oh, it, oh, yeah, all right, we get some death stuff in here. You know, it's not like a ton of jump scares or where we're terrified. It's more just like fun and scary. Mm -hmm. And I love that. Mm -hmm. I think that also we're watching um, these two cousins in their story come about this. It's really like I'm looking at Jake and, and, and Junior. It's kind of the center of this. And there's so much room to grow. Um, I think it this this on the pop horror thing, this franchise does such a good job about is like really giving messages while also being so fun because we have all of the like you know, who the F cares, queer, gender fluid, doesn't matter. Like, right. and, the, and so this franchise embraces that. And then we also have some, some really serious deaths. I've always said this, you know, I think it, it's one thing to have dead people in your life. It's another thing to watch, be there the second somebody dies. Yeah. It's completely different to see a dead body and to be with somebody from the second they're alive to the second they're, they're dead. dead. Yeah. And Junior and Jacob both now have that. Yep. Where they've both watched so Jacob with his dad as he gets electrocuted and he's there when when his dad goes from alive to dead and Junior when his mom hits the shields from alive to dead. It's just like the watching these two enemies, but they have so much lived experience that is similar. I'm so curious where they go. And we know that this show is going to be deep, but we know it's going to be fun. And that's like the perfect balance. And the other kid just watched from living to dead, too. His mom down the stairs. Uh, and I just hit you. Sorry. That's the exact same that Devin. Exactly. Yeah. Like you're there for the actual death. Yeah. Not, not awake, not after. Like just there's something that that does to your body when you're in a room with somebody who, who one second is there and one second is gone and you're that age. Agreed. That's it's why just, I feel like he's going to go after Lexi's parents with her there. I feel like. He's going to leave them in the same boat to suffer and then take care of them or not. But we got to have some, like Devin Sawa's character, I think is safe. Yeah. Um, 
so we know he's sticking around and let I don't know. Well, maybe mayor the the mayor and then Where uh, is Devin uh, uh, gonna go? The, the 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 psychiatrist dad could be Where's Devin gonna go? I don't know cuz I mean they have to keep him around otherwise Do you I, think that they're going to take do you think that Devin Sawa is going to take him in? Yeah, because he he was fighting with the wife before he's like it's my brother. Like what do you expect me to do? We can't not have Yeah, but Dev, the Devin kid is not related at all to him. Oh, I'm so sorry. Yeah, I'm sorry. I was thinking about Jake. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. You know oh. what I mean? Now, now Devin's an mean. orphan. And now I know what's what going to happen with him. That's true. That's true. I think that is Jake la- is going to have to convince Sawa to say he's got nowhere to go, man, and he can't go in th- into the foster system. Like, Or maybe Lexi's mom tries to do it for good publicity or something. Oh, that's smart. especially Because we got to keep him in the fold. I agree. If we, we put him in the system, to. he's moving, and we need him on the show. So. We need him here. Yeah. That's- so many questions. So much to do in these two, and we Ugh. we know we have seasons to come. We better make it to to, to season two. That's y'all. up you to you guys. Sharing this and liking the crap out of it, like we need like eight to ten thousand likes. Like, come on now. Every person who watches, if you like, please, then I like you. We love you so much. Yeah, that's true. Do we have anything else we have to tell them, Tara? No, except that we love you. Get your shirts, For leave real. comments, leave a like, share these videos. So much love. Later, rejects. 